All right, one more time. 41 inch sling. Got 50 to 58 inch, sorry, 50 to 58 gram concrete glands. And uh, I'm warm up with a tennis ball. Golf ball. Seem to break 70, not really trying, trying to get clean releases today. 58.8. <laughs> My focus is clean releases, not speed. Six. Sixty six. Sixty six meters per second. It's like one hundred and forty nine miles an hour. same speed. They all pretty feel pretty consistent. 57. Total bad release on that. Just <laughs> slipped out early. Don't know where it went. Last one, 50.6. Ah, speed-wise that was good, but bad release. One more. Sixty point one. That one felt really good. Good clean, good speed. Probably 67, 68. All right, let's go see if we can find it. Turn off my uh, speed gun. Going right between those two hills. I just hope that these didn't land in these cracks. Look at the cracks in the ground. If it goes in there, I don't find it. I 
This was my nominal aiming point. See if we... can actually find any. Despite being bright yellow, they're really hard to find. Mostly because they always settle into a dip or a crack. So unless you're on top of it, you can't find it. This is about where I usually land, so that uh, bale of wire, or that bundle of wire over there is just about 250. So, this is about 300. Let's see if I can find one before I turn the camera off. Do you guys believe me? Oh, I do find one at 300. I've done it before. Hopefully I do it this time. I had one that went a little bit to the right here. So I'll check out here and then move left. There's those two hills again. It's crazy to me that like a 20 by 20 air, oh my gosh, there's one. Holy moly, which one was that? Fifty-eight point six. That's the one I threw. That's one of the ones I threw. Holy moly! This one's gonna be crap. I just ended the video. This one's definitely this fifty-eight point six is definitely over three hundred. Let's check it, and then I'll put it up to the camera, hopefully, and you can see it. Three thirty-nine. Three thirty-nine. Oh, I'm so happy about that. All right, let's see if I can. Where'd the post go? Where's my post? Where the heck is my post? Okay, sorry, I have to get this aligned better. Where is it? There's the post. Yeah. 330 at least. Oh yeah, I mean, you know, you can see this ground. I mean, they come in so far, so like close to vertical, I doubt they get much roll, maybe five to 10 meters, but definitely broke 300. All right. So super happy about that. Here's that 58.8, and there's the bundle of wire. So this is only like 255 probably. 255. <laughs> so you can see what a difference the, the release makes. If it's not a clean spiraled release, they just go nowhere. It's kind of nuts. Same, same speed, just so much more drag. Anyway, I'll try to find a couple more if I can. I got through five, so if I can find any more, I'll, I'll tell you. Oh, finally, walking for, looking for like 15 minutes. I found two more. I found that 60.1 that I just threw the last one. There's another one over there. So this one is sitting at, Oh, and if you're wondering, I'm aiming off to the side of that post because if I aim at the post, it hits the hill or hits the ground behind the post, which is way further away. So I just aim at the hill that's right next to the post. So it's the same distance or pretty damn close. Two eighty three for this fifty six point one. 
All right, I think I got one more sitting out here somewhere. Or two more, maybe? I don't know. I'm gonna keep looking for a little bit, but yeah, the, you know, the point of this whole thing is, I mean, I went from, you know, 260 all the way up to 340, 330, 340, somewhere in there. Just, like, speed was essentially the same.